The premise of the coaching manual is simple. Get the knowledge, pass it on. You don't have to have a lifetime's worth of soccer experience to be a great youth soccer coach. You don't have to be a tactical genius either. However, knowledge goes a long way. Firstly, the coaching manual equips coaches with the right information about what and how to coach the game. Secondly, watching the video guides gives everyone the confidence to deliver the information on the field. A big box, 40 by 40, and a little 10 by 10 in the middle. We had nine players, we had three sets of three. So one on the outside, one in the middle, one enemy on the outside. So we're going to start off by having three people in the middle uh, and then six people on the outside. They'll be split into teams of three. They will be focusing on passing into the middle, opening up to receiving, passing out, and then moving into the space vacated by their previous teammate. Tate's going to pass the ball into Caleb. Caleb's going to open up and make a pass to Andy. Again, we're looking to go through the process of scanning. So he's going to receive from the man on the outside get himself half turn, so we scan to know where the decision making pass is going to be. So he's going to get, get the ball, receive, and pass out. It's about the person in the middle receiving, opening up, and turning your head to be able to scan and find the open man, okay? We're going to do this for a minute, and then we'll switch who's in the middle. Go! Well done! The little progression was that now, sometimes if it's tight here, they don't, they don't always have to play forward, they can play back. And if the man on the outside turns his back, they can switch. So then it, it just teaches the man coming in that he has to scan now because he doesn't know where the man from the inside square is going to go. He might go in behind him. So now he might have to change his position, he might have to stand and change to, to scan to go out that way. So that's just trying to get them thinking, thinking really. So now I've got to understand that turn back in, Chris, you do. I'm coming in, my time is right. The ball comes in. I know where he's ran to because I'm scanning and I'm playing out, okay? Everyone so understand. So when you're coming into the middle, I want you guys to focus on how you approach the middle in order to put yourself in a good position. You should be able to see both your teammates. So if I'm checking into the middle here, I see Caleb's there, I want to call for, yes Andy, I want to take my touch here to set me up, creating my space, and I've also made my passing over here. Right now as I pop out. So uh, the session went uh, pretty well today. Uh, it was good to be able to see just boys, girls, kids of all different ages being able to interact in the same drill. It was really important to stress the importance of opening up, scanning to make sure you know where the ball is coming from, as well as how to pass the ball coming out of the square and finding your space with your teammates. First time, one of the first times we had doing this, so uh, obviously room for improvement, but a lot of good work and good effort from them. Uh, and I look forward to seeing everyone else on the pitch. Become a great coach whatever your starting point. The Coaching Manual. Get the knowledge, pass it on.